What is up, YouTube? I had to do a small bank run out here in a small town, Ohio. Got pennies, pennies, pennies. So get ready for a live stream, guys. See you guys soon. What is up, guys? Just made it home with the bag. And I stopped at the gas station for Ohio lottery ticket. Scratch it off with my fifty dollar piece golden buffalo. After I'm done eating dinner, load of potatoes with the wife. Stay tuned and see what I find, guys. Ohio bag. Okay, guys, just scratched that off with my fifty dollar gold buffalo. Got my three dollars back. Nothing more. Now let's get to the road hunt. I was on the road. Hunting for pennies. Lincoln Sense. Stay tuned. Okay, guys, I'm back. Four rows in. Found my first real weedy. I think this is somebody's collection, though, because I'm going to look at these again under the scope. These from 98s, 2000s, 99. And these are very beautiful. All of those are like 2000, 2001. All the way to 2013, they are almost like uncirculated condition. So I think I got somebody collection. I don't know till I get through the rest of this bag. But let's check out the date on my first Ruiti in four rows. What date is that? Let's see if I can get that date. Nineteen, so weedy. Nineteen, nineteen. Hold on, guys. Let me get the micro lens. Okay, I got the micro lens on the micro lens. I'm having trouble seeing this date. Should be a nineteen nineteen or nineteen on I don't think it's a nineteen oh nine. Is it? Is it 1909, guys? I'm not sure. It's not a VDB. It's a 1909. So excited. Okay, guys, stay tuned. I'm going to have to get closer to this date somehow. Stay tuned, guys. Okay, guys, that was a 1919S. I just found my first Canadian. It's a 1970s. A lot of 1970s in this batch. And a little green spots there. And I found some 
plain dates. This one has a good condition. And these kind of look like they double dyes. Also, I think I found some new discoveries, guys. So, stay tuned. I'm on the fifth roll in. Still searching. See you guys soon. Guys, check it out. I'm only eight rolls in. And I found... I don't know what they call this. It's a commemorative, I know. A flying duck. <laughs> That's what I call it. It's the 18... What year is on there? 1867, 1967. The commemorative Canadian cent, one cent. Just found that, guys. Just found it. Also found that was in 1919. And I found another 2009 beautiful condition. That's the presidential. The presidential. Yes, sir. Look how pretty that is. I love my 2009s. And this is an awesome find. I'm about to put this in the cardboard slab. And I'm going to let you guys know what else I find shortly. Okay, guys, I just found a beautiful, a, I would say it's a mint state, the toning on this Canadian scent. It's a young head, and guess what date it is in the shine, look how it shines. Take a guess at what date this is. 62. Beautiful 62. Now look at this 64 I found in the same row. And it's rough. <laughs> and it's rough. But it's a keeper. And that's my flying scent right there. I'm going to slab both of those because I'm keeping those. Now let's look through this row. I think I saw something. Wow. Guys, look at that. That's a King George VI. 1943. That's why I like going to the small banks. I like going to the small banks and, and unknown unknown places. I got a beautiful 1943. Wow. I can't believe it. Stay tuned, guys. Let's, let's first, let's see what else this row has. I don't, I don't know. It's going to surprise me. Because I'm, I'm loving this box so far. Got some nice, some nice old coins in here. I don't know if somebody would have this in the penny jar. Look at that 66. Look at that 66 besides that. That spot there, and it looked like it's just toning. That 66 is beautiful. If that if that toning wasn't there, or that spot wasn't there, I'd send this off to get graded. That is a beautiful 66. Let's see what else we have. Rather do this roll on camera, because I found two. Canadian sense. Let's see what else is in here. I found two Canadian cents in one row. 83. Look at the 83. It's like it never been touched. It just shines. Steady dropping coins, coins. The coins are falling. Just skimming through. The 2000s I'm going to put to the side so I can look at them under my scope. It's a 98. I'm putting that to the side. Just want to show you guys these beautiful coins. Like They coming out like they was just hiding. Like Someone just kept them. Look at that 76. Look at that 76. <laughs> These coins are over 50 years old almost. 
and they still got luster and shine to them. Stay tuned, guys. I'll show you what I come up with next. Okay, guys. I just put my favorite ones into the slabs already. The flying uh, bird commemorative. The 19. What was this? This is the 1962 in beautiful condition. And the King George 43. Still got the 1919S there. Still got two Canadians here. And this is the hardest 2009 never find as the presidential. Found that in rotation. Beautiful 1964. Wish those spots went there. I'd send that up to get graded. Now, just open my next roll and found a dime. So I'm 10 cents richer. <laughs> 10 cents richer. Let me have this dime. I actually stuck to a penny. Check these edges and make sure it's not silver. Okay, so that's going going back. Thank you for making me 10 cents richer. Appreciate it. Or 9 cents richer. It's missing a penny. I'm trying to look at it without touching that gooky stuff. 294D. Cool. Alright guys, stay tuned for find something. I will share it. Thirteen rows in guys. It's my thirteenth row. Just found another weedy. Found this beautiful tone. Tone uh, one cent here. Memorial scent. I don't know what that is, but let's check this weedy first. Uh, there's no VDB on it, so we should know. And that's not the infamous. I wonder what date it is, though. 46 Denver. Cool. I'm going to add that to this pile. So if you guys want to auction, and win this auction of 100 some Wheaties. If you guys already know now, it has a 1946 in there. And I'm putting this 1919S in there. Stay tuned for more. Try about to clean these up. I was dropping pennies. So these two are going in the bag. Open the next row. Let's see what we have here. Can't believe I found a dime though. I found a dime. Maybe ten cent richer. Nine cent because I probably was missing a penny. Let's see what uh this is bad looking. Maybe two sixty-four. Ugh. We need gloves on again. Yeah, always good to have gloves on. Seventy-four. Sixty-seven. Okay. What's this? What? Is that a nineteen oh nine, guys? Is that a nineteen oh nine? God, I'm shaking right now. I can't even hold this penny. Please let it be VDB. Can't see it. It's not. I found my first 1909. Wow, I'm in shock. I'm lost for words. 
Wow. Wow. That's a 1909, guys. And I'm only my 14th row in. I'm good at sniffing out a collection, I swear. Look at that. I don't know, guys. I might add it to the auction, but I might keep this. It's not a VDB. It's my first 1909. Wow. Let's see what else this row has. Let me put this to the side first. This is beautiful, whatever this is. Got a 62. Putting that to the side. It's a keeper. Wow, I can't believe I found a 1909. That made the whole batch of pennies, whether good or bad, like just, it just made up for it. Even though I found those good ones right there. 1909, I couldn't, I can't even believe it. That bag produced a 1909. Can't even look through the rest of these, I'm like. Shh. 81s, There's a lot of 81s in this. 2015. 77. Can't even look through these guys. Ooh, 2009. Know the back of that. So that's another one. That was his formative years of Senate, Illinois. So that robe gave me a 2009 and a 1909. That had to be somebody's collection, guys. In one row, a 2009. And 100 years later, a 2009. Can't be serious. I'm very happy. And I don't even remember the bank I went to. Stay tuned, guys. Okay, guys, 15 rows in. It's a dirty one. Looks like another weedy here. That 1909 blew my mind, guys. That 1909 blew my mind. So I'm checking the back now first. Okay. Let's check the date on here. It's 58D. Is that a 58? The last year. Making it tough to see this day, guys. I think it's a 58. It's just been beat. I'll take it. It's a weedy. Sit it over here with the other guys. Might put all these weedies in that bag, guys, for the auction. It's almost 150 weedies in there. And now you know a little bit of what you got. <laughs> Maybe. Stay tuned. Guys, check it out. This has to be somebody's collection. They painted on this one. And they drew on Lincoln's face on this one. I guess they tried to... <laughs> That's a 71... So those are going back. Now check this out. Just looking at this 80. 1980. And I saw this. Didn't see the back of it. Just saw the front. What does that say, guys? 
1910. It's almost a whole collection of Wheaties. Just almost found a whole collection, guys. That's a 1910. And a 1909 in the same bag. And I still have about 15 rows left. Guys, this is nuts. Oh, it's beat on the back, though. Still looks good to me. It's a weedy. 1910, second year. Wow. Those small banks, guys, I'm trying to tell you. Keep watching. Check the change. Wow, guys. I just found a 1910 right there. Found the 1909 a little bit earlier. Now, check this out. I think it's another Canadian. It might be. It just looks old. Might not be. Maybe a weedy. Nope. False alarm. Stay tuned. Nine cent richer again, guys. Found ten more cent. My wife, Black Steel Girl, found this dime in her row. She's sitting here helping me. So stay tuned, guys. Another nine cent on top. It's always good. Okay, guys, just found one more dime. Got that green, ugly corrosion on it. But hey, nine cents richer. We're just going through these guys and ran up on a weedy. Let's see what date it is. That's the back of it. You guys guess that date. Look like a fifty four. Plain. Cool, it's a weedy. Okay, guys, this was the best box ever. It's a wrap up. This is one of my best boxes ever. I have these beautiful Canadians. This is a 1962. Look like it's an AU condition. It's shining. This is a King George the Sixth, nineteen forty-three, nineteen forty-three. Yep, just found that. Slabbed them right away. This is the flying scent. Never had one of these. My first one. Very happy about this box. Some beautiful reds, 1962, 1962D, 1960. So this box, I almost found as many Wheaties as I found Canadians, and that and that made me very happy. This is the one that made me very, very happy. It's a 1909. Might stick that in the auction. 1910, almost got a whole set. 1919S, some beautiful Wheaties. 1920 popped up. Very happy about these Wheaties, guys. Very happy. And also the commemoratives, presidential, the Senate years, Indiana Law, uh, Indiana. Log. It's Kentucky birthplace. Two presidentials. So I'm gonna put these under the scope and see if it has the extra thumb. See if the die area on the reverse. Also some more reds. Very beautiful guys. Some 63s, 64s. I'm gonna put these under the scope. These are some 69s, some 70s. You know, I keep a pile of 2017 P's. I keep all of those. 
Thank you guys for tuning in. Black Steel Reserve. And Miss Black Steel helped me with this. We got through the whole count. These going in my book. Thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button, guys. Hit that subscribe button. More videos to come soon. I appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. Black Steel Reserve, checking out.